This is called patterns. It goes like this. And I feel as if every day I've lived, I've lived to help me understand the viewpoints of the people who I loved and lost, who wandered off. The ones I acted badly to, who acted bad to me, and all the ones who held my interests close. I've learned that it all had to be exactly as it was. For those immersed in the dull fog of years, long since grave bound, we blazed skunk in the playground. You lay down beside me, held my hand, and asked if you could stay around. This was way back, before abortions, addictions, or breakdowns. With wild eyes, we laughed colour into the concrete of this grey town. And now I make the page drown in all this drunken poetry. I know it's you, you know it's me, and this was all supposed to be. I know it's you, and you know it's me, and this was all supposed to be. But mate, the kids I see scuffing their feet at the bus stops, they are the same as us. Sure of their immortality, they live to play the dangerous games. They trust that they can never part. They trust that they can never age. They trust this world was made for them and that nobody knows the rage they would unleash at those who dare to trespass against the ones they love the most. They do not know that soon enough all love is dreams and ghosts and that the only ones who can hurt us are the ones who care and love us well. So now I watch them from afar because I am a grown up now with much to tell. Thinking, look, I don't want to remember or forget. I don't want to harbour days. It's just so hard to place the past in context when the past, it, oh, it rules my darkest days. But I'm illuminated by the sparks that fly when I realise we live the same stories until we have played every part, until we know our reasons and have found peace with all of them splintered things. I think of you, the summer from which my endless winter springs and I tell you I know my reasons and I've found peace with all of our splintered things but still I think of you, the endless summer from which my endless winter springs. So to the past then, come to the past. Let's journey back and make some sense of now by making sense of then. And I'm sure that we can be friends again. I'm just so far from who I was when last we spoke, but man, I'm still the same girl. I'm still a wreckhead with a method to a madness who watched the flames curl around us as we burnt a burn of fire-hearted kids. And I've made peace with all we did and I forgive. And I will give my time to all of you at some stage Cause those were fun days before the young aged Bunk in school just to do nothing Right time, wrong place And yes, some gave their minds to the madness And others got caught in the routine All I know is we were blessed to have ever made acquaintance We kicked our cans along the pavement we were the valiant amongst the vacant. This is for those who gave my voice its cadence and pushed me to seek my strength in statements. Patterns. Everything is balanced by these patterns. I have seen them in a way that I relate to my companions. Look, in everything that happens there are patterns. I mean it, everything's in stages, cycles, phases, and they all have these patterns at their basis. I'm talking patterns, fits of passion, waking up wishing you hadn't. Took me 23 years just to fathom out that pattern. The same situation, endlessly repeating. All the changes are the roles you play, and once you start, <laughs> once you start learning all the roles you've played, you will understand the roles you gave to others. There are patterns in the way we fall for lovers, in who we recognise the others who have loved us badly well. Well, either way, I've seen the patterns in the past, and it was enough to blow my mind away. You see, there was, there's this man I've known for years, and still to this day do I know him, and I love him very much, but it's very hard for me to show him, because back then and even now, I feel there's something that I owe him, and that feeling should be going over time, but no, it's growing. We were kid mates, making mistakes, playing give take, big hearts, battling them big snakes, rattling their tails. Look, he was like the wind in my sails, and I was like the water for his keel, it was real. It used to hurt my flesh that his water scars of heated steel. He used to hurt his flesh just to see if he could feel to cut a long short, right? He weren't ever really the strong sort. Got into the wrong sport, big swigs, long snorts. And caught in that spiral, he saw attempts to help a spiteful. Pretty soon he got so down that he got on the brown and word got around and people did not like the sound. So they told me to stop popping round to see him and I kept disagreeing but soon he was a different being. You see, he got into stealing, robbing, I'd still see him frequent, often, eyes all throbbing, weeping, sobbing, freaking out. He wouldn't speak about the things that made him weak because doubt would stop his throat mid-sentence. And yes, his face would paint repentance but his actions spoke dependence. 
That's when our friendship became difficult to say the least. He played the beast so well I wondered how we'd ever make our peace. That's when we drifted. We never argued. It just became clear that the parts of him I loved so well had slowly disappeared. I said, you look the same, but I don't recognize you. I'm looking you dead in the face and I can't find you. I don't like the way we always talk in the past tense, but you can't explain the present till you work out what the past meant. You see, I'm looking right at you, but you ain't present no more. And yes, you laugh the same laugh, but its echo is flawed. Now when we talk, I feel like I'm walking on the edge of a sword and I've tried to forget about the past, I just remember it more. And yes, I'm here for you, whatever the score. But it don't really feel like you're my friend anymore. The more we talk about it though, the wider the space. Then days are gone when we were 13, dividing our apes. Making promises would always relate. I tell you straight, I'm well versed in the chapters of lies. I know dishonesty. It's not how much or what you're using that even bothers me. It's the fact you feel you have to lie about it that really worries me. Because you might well be my oldest friend. We were at our closest when the days were young, like our hearts, heads and handprints, standing on the grand plinth of reckoning that we could never grow either old or apart, but that was then. And we might never be a team again, but I remember backies on your bike when we were teens, and then I remember how the other day we linked up and had nothing to say. Fuck it, bruv, I miss you. I just wish it weren't an issue. But you look the same, mate, and I don't recognise you. I'm looking you dead in your face and I can't find you. I don't like the way we always talk in the past tense. I got so much shit to say, but when I see you, I just can't vent. I don't like the way we always talk in the past tense. But you can't explain the present till you work out where the past went. The past went to the patterns. I mean it, everything is balanced by these patterns. I have seen them in a way that I relate to my companions. Look, in everything that happens, there are patterns. Everything's in phases, cycles, stages, and they all have these patterns at their basis. I mean it, patterns. Fits of passion, waking up, wishing you hadn't. Took me 24 years just to fathom out that pattern. Same situations, endlessly occurring. All that changes are the roles you play. Now, once you start observing all the roles you've played, you will understand the roles you gave to others. There are patterns in the way we fall for lovers, in who we recognise the others who have loved us badly well. Well, either way, I saw the patterns in the past and it was enough to blow my mind away. And then I looked at you with the same look that was looked at me before. And then I saw that I had become the same one who back then turned my heart so raw and now was turning yours. You were innocent and unaware of my displeasure. You moved towards me like you thought through being closer together physically, you could bring my heart back round to being brimful with your features. You didn't know my heart was brimful of someone else's. So, from beloved to lover, the other is always so vibrant. The violence of holding it in, the silence of skin against skin, illicitly kissing and slipping through hidden encounters while you, big damp eyes, you clutched me too tight and you wept in the mornings and I'm so sorry. But the patterns will be until they are no more. In the dawning of truth, the floor spins. My sickness is swelling. There ain't no telling my cerebellum, mate. It does what it wants at the cost of my health. But I meant when I said there could be no one else. Too little, too late, though. The patterns emerged and spelt destiny. This was the legacy left to me. Mismatched, staggered affections. You see, you either love them too much or you don't love them enough. And you were the same. Either embers or flame. Or coals going cold in the grate I maintain that the point of it all is to check for it next time. To know your own nature, see your own weakness. No more of this bleakness, this indiscreet sweetness. My heart still belongs to the one who completes it. There are oceans between us. As the patterns demand, the patterns advance and they shattered our calm into frenzy. So now I miss you, but it's pointless because you're gone. And if you miss me, it's pointless because you're gone. You're beyond and I keep you inside. I don't mean to, but do. Tonight if I sleep, my dreams will be of you. I keep you inside. I don't mean to, but do. Tonight, if I sleep, my dreams will be of you. I keep you inside. I don't mean to, but I do. And tonight, I won't sleep at all. No, tonight, I will shuffle my feet, mate, and I'll stare at these walls while the ugliness creeps from my core because I'm stained. And I can't keep my mouth from making the shape of your name. I'm shaking and strange and I'm thinking of you. And I'm sat in a pub now and I'm drinking for two. And I blink in the new light of night and I'm sinking the truth in a few pints. And I want to see you 
naked, stretched out, smoking before speaking the way that you do. But these are the patterns, though, and I must be patient. These are the common bonds between us and the ancients. We went from cheated on to cheater, from beated on to beater. But then we broke the cycle, didn't want to be either. I've been the flirter and the flirted out. I hurt them all, they hurt me back. I've been the speaker of the curses and the vessel that the words attack. And I say, who isn't in love with you? It seems we're all under your spell. Young and old, we're as hungry as hell for you to hold us and love us as well as we know you can. I really like holding your hand. So I find myself here as mad for you as once they was for me. It's sad but true that there is always a lover and a beloved. There is always another to nourish and courage and so with a flourish the cycle's completed, retracing the loop until it's defeated. And I will leave it up to the winds of time because I know you and I are of the same kind. I will leave it up to the winds of time because I know you and I are of the same kind. I will leave it up to the winds of time but I just can't drink you off my mind. It's weird. Since the first moment I touched you, I touched you so purely that all of me touched you. You're kind of someone I look down at and up to, but I met you to love you, so let me just love you. The patterns will teach me to trust you. The patterns will teach me to trust me. The patterns will kill off the hands that clutch me. These hands of dishonesty, there's clouds in the prophecy, obscuring the memories of days not lived yet. Quick. Let's skip town, walk along the seafront on a grey day, a hundred miles an hour on the motorway, broken window, loads to say, it all got blown away. So let's get wet in the rain, let's forget the regret, forget the pain, because now we're kissing the world into focus, and when you look out of them shining eyes, how can I not notice you're fragile just like me? We ain't as strong as they think we are, that's not to say it's an act. All I'm saying is I write poems for you all day long that you will never read. But what I lack in discretion, I make up for in passion. Me, I live at the mercy of patterns. See, Oscar Wilde once wrote, and when I read this, I believed this. The only way to get rid of a temptation is to yield to it. That's why I yield to the patterns, because I know that everything is balanced in these patterns. I have seen them in the ways that I relate to my companions. Man, in everything that happens, there are patterns. Everything's in phases, cycles, stages, and they all have these patterns at their basis. I mean it, patterns. Fits of passion, waking up again, wishing you hadn't. Took me 25 years just to fathom out that pattern. Man, the same situations endlessly occurring. And all that changes are the roles you play. So once you start observing all the roles you've played, you will understand all the roles you gave to the others. There are patterns in the way you'll fall for lovers, in who you recognise the others who have loved you badly well will out of the way. I saw the patterns in the past, it was enough to blow my mind away. I saw the patterns in the stars and they sang to me of brighter days. I hold your pattern in my arms and I swear I'm going to make you mine someday. That's it. <laughs> uh. Thank you, uh, thank you very much for watching. I've been Kate Tempest at Show Studio. Um, I don't have anything. Uh, I want to promote something, but I'm, I don't feel like I should after that. But my name's Kate Tempest, and if you like what you heard, then you can find me on the internet. My book's coming out in April, and I'm in a band called Sound of Rum, and our record's out now on Sunday Best Recordings. It's called Balance. Thank you. See you later. <laughs>